Welcome to my kitchen where I feel that food is your medicine. Hot Porter's here. Today I want to share with you one of my favorite recipes for using the healing herbs and it's making pesto. Uh, a woman who introduced me to using all different herbs in your pesto was Pat Crocker and she's the author of this amazing book, Healing Herbs Cookbook. She suggested that you don't just use the common basil, um, coriander mixture, that you incorporate all your different herbs. You can make your standard basil pesto, you can make it with rosemary, you can make it with pumpkin seeds. You can make it uh, with arugula, calendula. Today I'm going to uh, be making the standard uh, basil pesto, throwing in some little extra herbs. And I start with um, almonds. I use almonds instead of pine nuts because they're they're not as expensive and I've chosen to use my Vitamix because it makes pesto making really really simple but you can do it with your mortar and pestle grinding them or food processor whatever works good for you so in I have washed my almonds and I've put them in the bottom of the blender next I'm going to put in a big whack of garlic uh, we really like garlic, so we'll use like a big clove of garlic there. Um, then I'm going to put in my olive oil, a good dash, a little extra one, I like my olive oil. I'm going to put in some pumpkin seeds, a couple of handfuls. There's pre-measured. Next comes my basil leaves and my parsley that I have already just picked the leaves off there. I'm going to put a little bit of dash of water in here. Just there goes our cat JJ and I'm just going to blend this up Okay, let's see how that looks. It's still a little chunky there, but that's how I like it. Hi, JJ. Hi, buddy. He likes checking it out. Hi, bud. Okay, are you checking it out? Yeah. Then I put in my Parmesan cheese, grated Parmesan cheese. Mix that all up. And I am going to have this on some zoodles. Noodles made out of zucchinis. And uh, that's because I'm on a low carb diet. So it's delicious. You just a very nutritious meal. And you not only get the nutrition of all these great foods, but you also get the medicinal qualities, your garlic, parsley, uh, olive oil, pumpkin seeds, whatever other herbs you choose to put in there. And if you check out my, uh, below in the description here, I will include some other alternative recipes using different Things like calendula, uh, rosemary, arugula, pumpkin seed, all different ones. And I'll give you some of the health benefits of the products that were put in it. Hope you enjoy.